So what does this mean for the future of cybersecurity? The nature of these agentic attacks means we're dealing with velocity too, which gives security teams far less time to react. Anthropic states that the attacker was able to use AI to perform 80 to 90% of the attack campaign with human intervention only at critical decision points. That should be a reality check for security teams that don't yet recognize the critical role of generative AI in preventing cyber attacks. Your attackers are competent and they have the tools available to exploit your vulnerabilities at a pace that your non-AI assisted human analysts simply cannot keep up with. Your defense strategies must be proactive and must leverage artificial intelligence at the same pace. But here's the silver lining in all of this. This AI cyber attack actually serves as a blueprint that can be reverse engineered for cybersecurity purposes. The approach for identifying network topology and vulnerabilities can be used defensively, but instead of exploiting vulnerabilities, Claude or any other agent could be deployed to patch those vulnerabilities. This way you put yourself ahead of the attackers. Since you won't have to contend with Anthropic or any Frontier Lab actively trying to stop you in real time, like any potential cyber attacker would. The tools that make these cyber attacks possible are the same tools that can be engineered to bolster your cyber defenses.